Time now for a local, local five traffic report. The Labor Day weekend is all about celebrating the end of the summer with your family, so it makes sense that the roads are going to be busier than usual the next few days. And local five's Calvin Lewis is live with more on how you can stay safe as you head to your destination. Hey, Calvin. And Nate, good morning. That's exactly right. We've been sort of in the crosshairs between Wrightstown and Kakana this morning, standing alongside US 41 here, the northbound lane. We've got some traffic going on behind us. Uh, some of those, you know, making the early morning commute off to work, or even some of those making uh, some early holiday travels as this weekend marks, of course, a Labor Day weekend. And to join us this morning to tell us a little bit more about that traffic is Trooper. Aaron Pullman here. Aaron, thanks for joining us this morning. Uh, how busy of a time of a year is this specifically for you guys being a part of the, the Wisconsin State Patrol? Uh, coming into Labor Day weekend, uh, we're expecting a lot of traffic. Uh, we got drive sober, get pulled over going on, so we're going to be working a few extra hours on that, looking for anything we can possibly find. Um, it's going to be a busy weekend. We're definitely getting ready for it. What is the number one concern that you guys have, uh, you know, heading into this weekend? You mentioned the drive sober, get pulled over uh, campaign. Is it is it drunk drivers, drunk driving? Uh, honestly, it's everything. Uh, we're looking for unsafe driving behavior, following too closely, speed, uh, cutting people off, any sort of reckless, unsafe driving behavior. In addition to the drive sober or get pulled, pulled over push. And so, kind of looking ahead, you know, what, what can drivers sort of do to, uh, you know, be better prepared before they hit the roadway as they're packing their vehicles and, and sort of make your jobs <laughs> a little easier? Uh, as long as drivers are giving themselves a little bit of extra time to get where they're going, uh, there's going to be a lot of traffic falling out on the interstate, uh, as well as some of the other roads as well. Um, make sure they got enough gas in the vehicles, good air in the tires, uh, expect things to possibly be a little bit slow. Um, be prepared to move over. Uh, someone's pulled over on the side of the road, crash going on. Just be prepared to take the time, make sure they get where they're going safely. All right, Trooper Pullman, thank you so much for joining us this morning. You've been a real trooper, I guess you could say, in joining us. <laughs> I had to throw that out there. But and according to AAA this weekend, uh, the the gas actually the gas average for a tank of gas, boy, that's a mouthful, is, uh, is about two fifty eight a gallon, which is 25 cents cheaper than what it was last year. So a little bit more of an incentive for drivers to be, you know, hitting the roadway and traveling this weekend. We'll toss it back to you guys for now over in the studio.